pancreatic endocrine tumor is gastrinoma. What is the percentage? It is 50 percent. Understand this. 50 percent. Okay. Gastrinomas are mostly malignant or benign? Malignant. Gastrinomas are predominantly malignant tumors. Agree? Insulinoma. Next is the insulinoma. Insulinomas are benign tumors or malignant tumors? Insulinomas are predominantly benign. More than 60 percent of insulinomas are benign. Understood? Right? The next question that is asked is most common location of gastrinoma. Can you tell me? Duodenum. It is the C loop of the duodenum. It is the submucosal aspect of the duodenum. That is the most common location for gastrinoma. And gastrinomas are most commonly seen in gastrinoma triangle. How is a gastrinoma triangle that is drawn? The gastrinoma triangle is drawn by taking three points. What are the three points? First point is the junction of cystic duct and common hepatic duct. The second point is between the second and third part of duodenum. And the third point is the junction of body and the neck of the pancreas. So, three points. So, I will just draw this for you. Okay. Point number one, junction of cystic duct and common hepatic duct. Point number two, second and third part of duodenum, junction of second and third and body and neck of pancreas. Connect all these points. This triangle is called triangle of stabile, triangle of stabile or pasaro. So this triangle is called triangle of stabile or pasaro or otherwise called gastrinoma triangle. In this, it is most commonly seen in the C loop of duodenum, within the submucosal aspect of the C loop of duodenum. Got it? What is the pathophysiology? Pathophysiology. These are produced from G cells of the stomach, gastrin, or D cells of the pancreas. What it produces? Increased level of gastrin. So, gastrinoma produces increased level of gastrin to the tune of more than 1000. Take, uh, you, you have the page of uh, gastrinoma? Huh? You see, uh, 1000 nanograms or picograms per ml. Correct. So, picograms per ml, correct? So, what I given. So, units and numbers are very important for your national board. So, not to take any risk. I am not good in these numbers. So, I can make mistakes. So, that mistake should not be costly for you. Right? So, it should be 